Out of caution, Bethany House in Terre Haute took a pause on accepting new people when the pandemic began. Bethany House is a homeless shelter in Terre Haute. It's operated by Catholic Charities. Well, now they've come up with new guidelines to protect your staff, to protect their staff, volunteers, and the people who need help. News since Portia Williams checked out some of the safety measures being put in place. I stopped by the Catholic Charities today and talked with the Assistant Director Jennifer Buell. She told me they've started making calls to people who are on the waiting list for the Bethany's house. Buell says even though you may not be able to get in the same day, it's best to call them right away to get on the wait list. If you are accepted for the shelter, you will have to quarantine in the house for 14 days. When people are in common areas with others, they have to mask up. Only one family or individual can be in the kitchen at the same time. Jennifer says all of these measures are to ensure the safety of everyone. And then once that quarantine time period is up, then they of course will have more freedom to move about in the house and, and um, interact with, with others who are in there. But we just want to make sure that whoever is coming in to reside with us at Bethany House, that it's going to be safe for them. Buell adds, they never close down Bethany's house. They just stop accepting new people. If you are somebody you know is seeking shelter, you can contact Catholic Charities for the Bethany House. We have linked you to that information on our website, WTHITV.com. Back to you. Very good. Well, Kevin Orper